See, it's not an ordinary buttermilk. It's not a supermarket buttermilk. It's buttermilk that is extracted from the buttermaking process, which brings it down to being real. Hello, I'm Peppy from Peppy Sayer Butter Company. It just is what it is, buttermilk, the way from, from the butter making process. So in our case, we're taking creme fraiche, we're churning the creme fraiche, and we end up with butter and buttermilk. And that real product creates such beautiful products after that. Buttermilk for me is that acidic taste that I look for in cooking, and you can't find it in anything else. I'm Mike McInerney. I'm uh, the owner of Kitchen by Mike and I'm here to talk about buttermilk. Buttermilk is such a beautiful ingredient. It's got that lovely acidity and, and it's like drinking yogurt. So however you would use yogurt in a, in a recipe, you could use buttermilk. For instance, today I'm cooking, I'm, I'm pot roasting mutton leg in real buttermilk. And the reason I'm doing this is because buttermilk has this acidity. It gives the lamb lovely tenderness. The acidity cuts the, the richness of the, of the mutton. And, and also what happens is, is the curd separates and forms this beautiful golden layer on top of the lamb and it's like eating this beautiful rich cheese with the lamb it's just incredible you can't do that with standard buttermilk so that's just taking it to another level real buttermilk is a simple and natural ingredient and it has the potential to enhance the taste and the nature of the food as the producers and chefs make their creations. After tasting Peppy's buttermilk, I knew that I had to produce a product using this buttermilk and that's how I came up with the buttermilk iced cream. Hi, I'm Myrna from Dessert Makers. Buttermilk iced cream is made by mixing buttermilk with Peppy Sayer cream fresh and a sprinkle of sugar and then putting that in my churn and churn in it for about 10 minutes and then that's it. It's been great. People love the flavour. People are being introduced to real buttermilk and that's the main thing here, I think. Some people don't get it because they've never had real buttermilk and this is a really good way of introducing them to real buttermilk. I'm Alex Herbert, I'm from Bird Cowfish. For um, people that haven't used traditional buttermilk before, or, or any buttermilk in general, it's a fantastic product to use in, in cakes, and particularly, you know, a great one for the kids is the buttermilk pancakes, where you can substitute your normal milk portion for buttermilk, and it adds a, a, just a nice sourness that, you know, and I really like that balance of sweet and sour. My name's Kristen Allen. I'm a Sydney-based artisan cheesemaker. Peppy gave me a call one day um, and said, asked me if I had any use for any buttermilk. Um, and I'd been looking to make ricotta with buttermilk for a while. So I did a little tester using the buttermilk. Um, and first of all, the smell that uh, filled up this room was quite amazing. Um, just that lovely cultured sour um, smell and then once it was done I took a spoonful straight out of the pot and I think it just stopped me in my tracks and I couldn't do anything else for the day and just wandered around the house going oh my god this is the greatest <laughs> Peppy's buttermilk uh, because it's it's the real deal, you know, it's it's got the the cultures in it, um, the flavors just amazing. Um, that lovely sourness just makes the ricotta um, just gives the ricotta just this extra flavor that is unlike no other. And I've given it to so many different people, and they say it's the best ricotta they've tasted. You know, you can bake with it, you can braise in it, you can make dressings with it, you can make puddings with it, you can make cakes with it. And it's this lost acidity that you have to add other additives to your cakes or to your cooking when you can get it from the one product. Now, how wonderful is that? It's very exciting to see a lot of the chefs and producers wanting to take up this product and make stuff with it, produce with it, cook with it. And I'm really excited to think that this is the re-emergence of real buttermilk.
real buttermilk only comes from the buttermaking process. 